radiation levels increasing. I liked those pre-trip vision paintings of future EOS. Green fields, rivers, forests. Wonder what it'll really be like down the line. Fewer death storms would be nice. We'll get there. Pathfinder is enough to tip the balance. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Ketterhead, they appear to be fighting a Krogan. Is that... Drac? levels within acceptable limits. Telling me. <laughs> you could really handle yourself, kid. And I hear you're the one to thank for clearing up the sky. Had your number all wrong. You're not so bad yourself, old man. Maybe we should work together after all. This fight was pretty good, but you're still Nexus and green as a drill. Still, something tells me you've got potential. Be ashamed to waste that. I'm in. <laughs> Just point me to your ship and try to keep up. This is gonna be great. The first colonists sent audio logs about these regions back to the Nexus. And? Fairwinds Basin. Lowest radiation count in the area. Little bit of hope. Maybe more than a little.
This is where we'll build our new outpost. A real beginning. Prepping deployment order. You must choose what purpose this new outpost will serve. The Nexus doesn't get a say? Resources are at a crisis point. Protocol states this judgment call falls to the Pathfinder. With current supplies, you could build a military outpost focusing on defense and militia training. Alternatively, a scientific outpost could advance the initiative's research and discoveries. What do you think? Military outpost or scientific? Pathfinder's call, but research is no good if we're dead. Military. It's got to be science. Our colonists need to understand their home. Be advised that the first outpost placed by a Pathfinder will be a statement in itself. Fair or not, your choice will represent the initiative and its intentions in Andromeda. Consider carefully. A military outpost. We defend our own against the Ket. Or anyone else. Orders prepped. Ready on your signal. Andromeda Initiative. This is Ryder. Pathfinder. EOS is ready for deployment. Copy that. Outpost blocked inbound. And ready as hell. August Bradley, operational head for this block. Mayor now, I suppose. We're ready to make the most of what you delivered. It took a lot of people to get us this far. That's the work you'll continue. I hear that. Prodromos. That's what we're calling her. They're eager. I haven't seen eager for months. Eos is far from golden. But now it's defensible. Arguing that choice will come later. They think you did the impossible. The Nexus. I warned them, hoping was... irresponsible. You proved me wrong, Pathfinder. I appreciate your candor. We're all on the same side. I wouldn't go that far. The Reality Rider? You brought us time. But one outpost on a long-shot planet won't stop us from starving. You already have a lead on... something else? The nav point from the... vault. Now it gets complicated. The others are ready to officially sanction your efforts, to be a part of your success. We all want the initiative to succeed. But after failing for so long, no one agrees on how to do it. Be aware. That's all. Don't worry. I majored in glad handing during Pathfinder training. We're led by the best. Talk to Bradley. Later, we'll go over the extended job of Pathfinder. Until then. Tan's waiting on the Nexus.
Someone left a warning. Looks like a work crew thinks they can take control of the remnant. That's a recipe for trouble. Work crew rosters are posted publicly. The data pad mentioned Med Bay. A little work, we could find where to catch up with them. Try chatting with some soldiers at Prodromos. They're a straight-faced bunch. The cat don't pull their punches. With colonists on the line, neither can we. Prodromos... Sam? What was that? An eidetic trigger related to your father and the portions of my memory array he locked. What triggered it? Alec tied it to your progression as Pathfinder, not to a location. Puzzling as it may be, my programming is clear. Locating more of these triggers will unlock the memories. One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. Mayor Bradley. Pathfinder, good to see you. We're busy as anything thanks to you. Bit dusty, but we can adapt. It's worth it when it's your own. Make sure to keep a clear log of what you're doing. Well, let's save some bandwidth. Busted ass defeat initiative. Copy, paste, repeat. You go do what you need to on the Nexus. Follow that dot. There will be more to do on EOS later. Some key positions, Connor Supply, Ramirez Medical, Abram Science, Fox Engineering. With them and my major domo, we won't end up like site one and two. The first two outposts didn't have a chance. It was clear to everyone on the ground. I saw the brief. I'm making sure every one of our people is eyes wide. You changed this planet, but that doesn't make it easy. We'll use the efforts of those who went before. Good people, every last one. I'd have been honored to fail with any of them. I haven't reached the end of that trail, but not everyone died outright. Right. They tell me there were staggered evacs. If any want to try again, they're welcome. Oh, and Pathfinder, this is for you. It's our flag. Hang it where the Nexus can see. It's touched the soil of our first outpost in Andromeda. Make it real. Head for the Nexus, Pathfinder. For Dremels, we'll have more going on. Pathfinder, I hear you're to thank for a physics-defying atmosphere processor. That's me. I'm Ryder. Hanley Abrams, Director of Scientific Research on EOS, and Ryder of papers that start what the hell weather. Since we're prioritizing military defenses, we may be asking that question for a while. But, new galaxy, new world, and a really new start. Gotta keep up. How can I help you? How do you feel about EOS having a military outpost? Honestly, I don't like it much. This isn't what the initiative's for, is it? We need to study EOS, understand the remnant tech, but our budget's earmarked for military research. Activating that vault changed the planet. Anything to worry about? I don't believe so. Sadly, our equipment is tuned for incoming enemies, not watching the skies. But the storms show no signs of returning, and I know who to contact for remnant tech support. I'll take it. What do you make of Lieutenant Bradley? Determined as hell. And he has incredible faith in us to get this done. Bradley would carry this outpost on his back if he had to, and we'll make sure he never has to. I've gotta go. Keep up the good work. Uh, Pathfinder? Mind giving me your opinion on this? I'm planning classes for our first school, when we have one. Some say we shouldn't teach Milky Way history. All irrelevant now, apparently. <laughs> we were all shaped by that history. Our children deserve to know how and why. Agreed. Maybe you'll change a few minds. Thanks for stopping. Pathfinder. 
Pathfinder, Major Domo Evan Bell Scott. I have headaches so you don't have to. Rather, so Bradley doesn't have to. I've also coordinated with your cat expert. He wanted me to remind you to find him. I didn't assign a cat expert to Prodromos. Then he's a hell of a self-motivator. Here's the nav anyway. Precision is important. How did you come to the initiative? Like many, I was lost and looking for a purpose. That sounds loftier than it felt at the time. I was an insufferable ass. The training for the trip was probably enough to cure me of it. But I always took things too far. Didn't know how to stop alienating people until I was the alien. <laughs> See? Still insufferable. Sounds like you left some interesting circumstances. I miss the family, and maybe they miss me. But that doesn't mean I'd go back. I mean, we can't, but still. I like where I came from. It's a great place to be from. You know what I mean? I know exactly how you feel. Couldn't wait to be from somewhere. Like a bullet leaves a gun. Sometimes you just gotta go. Where'd you launch out of? The pale blue dot, Terra Prime. Big old boring Earth. I miss... I miss that wet dog smell after the first snow melts. I don't know why. What about you? Miss anything? I miss the time on the couch before media loads. Make your choice, and as a B-minus rom-com bounces between satellites, the size of the planet decides how long you wait in the dark. Your popcorn sounds nice, Pathfinder. Another time. Of course. Pathfinder. Huh.